something you never want to happen. Your diamond ring going down the drain or getting lost somewhere. Or getting flushed mm -hmm. down a toilet. That happened to a family in Rogers. Fox Science Rob Olson joins us now. Rob, great news here. They have the ring back. It's been more than a decade, though. Yeah, a pretty remarkable story here uh, about finding this ring at the wastewater treatment plant here in Rogers a couple of months ago. Remarkable story now about reuniting it, in fact, with its owner. The backstory, though, about how it's lost might be even better from a woman who admits she's a little bit clumsy about losing things. My whole life has been a comedy show. So <laughs> Mary Strand laughs at her knack for losing stuff. <laughs> And that ring she got as an anniversary gift 13 years ago, which was a little loose, and she wore for a grand total of a couple of months. Reached over and flushed the toilet, and the ring fell in, and it was swirling around, and I truly dove for it. Well, now she can laugh about that one, too. I was thinking, he'll never buy me another ring. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. Mary and her husband Dave live less than a quarter mile from the waste treatment plant in Rogers. So that flushed ring never went that far from home. So my coworker actually put on waders. He was down inside scooping debris up that was caught in front of it. It's where the ring was found while shoveling out built up gunk back in March. It had probably been buried down there most of those 13 years. But yeah, I mean, as far as us finding that ring, I mean, it's virtually impossible. What's also funny about this is that Dave owns a sewer and drain company. We've saved a lot of rings. Had immediately gone fishing for his wife's ring with an auger and a camera. 200 feet out. He didn't see anything. When the Met Council put out word of the recovered ring in April, they got 200 responses. Mary says she had to search pretty hard to find a photo so that jewelers could determine a match. Now happy to have it back, but what's also funny is it's not the only ring she's ever lost. One time my mom gave me a gold band that she had with the first ring dad gave her, and I used to smoke, and I was driving down 35W, and I threw the cigarette out the window, and there went the ring. <laughs> That one's not been found. If it is, then there's another story to be done. Now, the ring is, uh, as you might imagine, been thoroughly disinfected, but it's also a little bit banged up. So she says she's going to have it reset in another band, and yes, a band that is sized properly and stays on her finger. Back to you. I love that she so, has a sense of humor. About so this. glad that they were able to find her and the, the backstory and all of it. I just want to go hang out with Mary I and Dave. Am. They're amazing. They're so sweet. Yeah, <laughs> good stuff.